These are some of our lip and cheeks and these are some more, um, not these. So this right here is Sunshine State and I'm gonna use that today. It is like a really pretty rose gold color and it has like flecks, see that? It has flecks of gold in it. It is probably one of the lip and cheeks that when I open my palette, if I'm doing something in person, everybody wants that. And I feel so bad because they couldn't get it because it was limited edition and it was gone. So now it's back for the month of June while supplies last. So I'm gonna use it today. If you like it, then please order it because there's no guarantee that it's still going to be around. And again, it's called Sunshine State. So before my internet, um, conks out again. Let me just get started. So I'm going to use contour in a couple different places on my face, on my cheekbones, and I'm going to do this really fast because my internet keeps going in and out. And I really do want to get to Sun Sunshine State, which is the reason why I came on here. Um, just going to soften that. I'm not really blending it, but I want you to see <laughs> that it's not it's not scary okay I'm going to use my main highlight color just right around my eyes where it's very green and yellow I'm going to use my brightening shade in a couple different places here at the corner of my eye, the outside corner of my eye, up here between my forehead, I mean between my eyebrows on my forehead, and down here on my chin. Now I'm gonna go back and fill in the blanks with that first main highlight shade that I used. Just dipped into the wrong color. Did you see that confused look on my face? That looks very light for me, but it's fine. I can just go back in. <laughs> look how red my nose is. When I say I have a red nose, I'm not exaggerating, but watch that red nose disappear. All right, I've got the makeup where I want it. Now I'm gonna blend it. Which brush do I wanna use? I wanna use this one. This is a blush and bronzer brush. It's nice and soft and fluffy. So the product is where I want it to be. So now I'm just gonna blend those three different shades together. So those three different shades make up our foundation. It's called Hack, Highlight and Contour. Your main highlight is like your like typical foundation. Your brightening highlight is like your concealer and your contour is just that, your contour. And don't be afraid of it. Remember that dark line that I made? Look at that. I'm gonna go for a very natural look today just because I'm not going anywhere and I don't need to be like full glam. Like I said, my main purpose of getting on here is to showcase sunshine state so i will do that in one minute because i like to do my eyebrows regardless so i'm gonna cheat and look in my mirror down here and fill in my brows so just bear with me for one minute because i swear if i put that lip and cheek on i'm gonna look i'm still gonna look see how i, I well i shouldn't say i look sickly um I, I want to brighten my face with that color, with that lip and cheek, sunshine state. But I want to give you the full impact of it, of what it would look like on a typical day. And on a typical day, I do my brows. And doing my brows is as simple as this. I'm using Trust Eyeshadow to fill in my brows. Remember I said all in one compact makeup? One layer, one compact, 
I'm a little crazy on this one. This is, honestly, this is this color right here. Trust. Look at that. Look at how that made my eyebrows just pop out. I like my eyebrows on the darker side. If you want to try this, reach out to me and I can recommend um, an eyeshadow color for you so that you can do your brows too. All right, let's get over to Sunshine State. Like I said, this is, um, this is Sunshine State right here. So let me pop that out. This is what our tins look like. They are metal. Our compacts are magnetized. And um, so when you run out of something, you just pop it out and buy a new one and pop it back in. So again, this is Sunshine State. June shade of the month and I'm going to show you what it looks like on again it is I would say it's like a peachy pink I like to say it's rose gold just because I think that that describes it perfectly it's like a rose color not like red rose like like when you think of a rose colored something and it has gold in it so these flecks of gold are not like a shimmer. They're not like something that is going to be overly obvious on your face. I mean, look at that. I'm just gonna rub my finger in it to put it on my lips so you could see it on here. It's so pretty. I will take an after picture. I took a before. Again, that's what it looks like on my finger. Perfect for summer. Just subtle enough, gives you a little bit of that like shininess, but not like the shininess that I don't like, the dewy look. Speaking of which, I am not even going to use a setting spray today. Since I'm not going anywhere, I will just set my makeup because you always want to set it, whether you're going somewhere or not. Because if I pick up my phone and put my phone to my face, this is going to be on my phone. And nobody wants that. So I like to set it regardless. And if you've been here at all, you know that I will usually um, spray my face or spray a, like a big brush and dab that all over my face. Because that setting spray will lock in this makeup. But setting powder will also do that. So because I'm not going anywhere today, I really don't want to like overly set it. I just don't want it to transfer off my face. So I'm gonna put this setting powder where I would typically put it, which is under my eyes, down my nose, my lip, and my chin. I'm kind of like doing the same thing I did with the makeup. I'm doing like paint by number. And then I'll just kind of dab a little bit on over my cheeks. Where I put that contour and where I put um, Sunshine State. Put it up there. A little too much on my nose. And then always, because I think I look half asleep when I don't have mascara on, I'm not gonna do my eyes. I'm not gonna use any eyeshadows today. Just a quick I mean, look at that. It looks like it just put false lashes on. This, by the way, is from Thrive Cosmetics. We do not sell a mascara yet. I like to say yet at the end of that. Just I'm kind of putting it out there into the universe, hoping that Kara comes up with a revolutionary way to do mascara because mascara is just so saturated in the cosmetic field right now. Well, not just right now, but always. So she's not gonna make the same old product just to make the same old product. 
So I hope she is hard at work thinking of a way to revolutionize mascara for us. And because I am a little bit crazy, I don't like that on my bottom lashes. Well, I shouldn't say I don't like that. I don't like to use that applicator on my bottom lashes. If they made that mascara, just got it on my face and I will show you how to fix that boo-boo. So I just doubled down on that and did it again. Don't smear it. We don't want to mess up our makeup. Just let it dry. If you're like me, it drives you crazy that it's there and your initial instinct is to wipe it away, but don't do that. If you're watching, say hello. If you are watching this on repeat, please do hashtag repeat so that I know that people have seen it, okay? <laughs> Just disregard that for a sec. I am because there's my brush. It's probably right in front of my face. It was. I like to contour my nose. And even though I'm not going anywhere, it's like two things I never used to do, which was fill in my eyebrows and contour my nose. Even if I'm not going anywhere, I still feel like I have to do it. Also, I like to show you just how easy it is. See, I drew that line. Well, you don't want that line there, right? So you draw the line and then you just kind of blur it out. But be really careful not to go onto the bridge of your nose. So if you go onto the bridge of your nose, again, it's an easy fix. I just like to use my finger. You pick up your highlight shade and just go down the center of your nose with it. And see, oops, see how slim that made my nose? It's like a nose job. Okay, this mascara is now dry. So I'm gonna take, this is our line brush, this fully end and I am going to just flick it away. See that? And I did not mess up my makeup, right? I'm starting to look alive again. All right, 